Hey folks, Daily Lance Vlog for the, I've never said this before, the 29th of February. How good is that? How cool is that? Actually, not that cool at all. Cor, how you doing? Is it actually the 29th of February? It is actually yeah. the 29th of February. Oh, he stinks. We are asking for it. We yeah, really exactly. want you to do. Not taunt him with that ball. Yeah. My love yeah. for the dogs. Hi, buddy. So, Cor, give us an update on how you're doing. Good. Yeah? Yeah. No complaints. No anxiety this week. Can you confirm that? I'm now speaking to Liz. Yeah, Liz. He hasn't had any anxiety issues. Carl, stop. Ah, oh, but there's other issues. I can tell. <laughs> what other uh, issues? I don't know. Uh, okay, Riggs, down. Uh, okay, so I, I want to ask you, uh, because uh, you have not done the Daily Lands blog since I was sick, right? What do you and mean I, you were sick? I puked a couple of times. Uh, okay. Yeah. And you My know, condolences. I can officially tell you that for two guys with emetophobia... Who, by the way, I have had um, at least every every speech I've given, someone has raised their hand up when I asked that. Mm. I, it's unbelievable how many people actually have that one particular phobia. But do you think that you're further ahead now in dealing with the fear of throwing up and the fear of being around people throwing up than yeah, you were? But, oh. but it doesn't, the problem is, like, I haven't really experienced being around people who puke, so I don't know. If my wife was to puke, I'd probably sleep on the porch but other than that like I haven't really noticed anything yeah other than are you more afraid of throwing up yourself or having uh, somebody yeah. throw up around you no I'm definitely better now but I mean I'm not an eight-year-old kid anymore so I'm a little bit better at coping with it but still not my favorite thing in the world to think about no no I, I but I, I it doesn't control your life which is really the key here no but I would, I would prefer to not be around sick people as much as ever. Right. Uh, and how about the, how about the coronavirus? Where does uh, it, where, where does that fall in terms of anxiety for you? Well, okay. Well, there's two sides to it. The first, the first side would be that I know more about it because of my anxiety, and I know that there's probably a less than zero percent chance you're going to contract it. Um, so I worry about the flu. So I guess the stomach flu. Yeah, not like, not, not no, like not all the flu. You don't want to get the flu. It's no any of the flu. It doesn't matter if it's stomach flu or influenza. Right, like, but influenza kills people yeah, so, every year. The stomach flu does not kill people. No, but the problem is like you're not going to contract the coronavirus from someone. You're probably you have a very good chance of contracting the flu from someone. That's very it's true. In flu season. So. Right, but uh, I. But I I have done enough research on it because of my anxiety. So I'm, um, I'm okay with it. Right. I'm coping. Right. Yes. Well, I think that's huge progress. And I am, uh, it's just really good for me to hear you say that, you know, that no anxiety this week, you know, like you have, you know. I mean, I have washed my hands so much that they started to bleed, but other than that, I'm okay. Sore hands is way better than where we were at different times over the course of our, our lives together. Probably. Uh, all right. I want you to, uh. Why don't you wrap this up? Okay. Well, okay. What day was it today? Uh, you don't have to give the date now. Well, it was February 29th. Land's we're here 24-7, 364 days a year. Or, or 365. Could it be 365 this year? Yes, it could. Oh, that's an extra day. Yeah, it is. You kind of bill for that out, those hours? Uh, <laughs> Are we what? done? Yeah.